all wired up about to test it as I had mentioned in an update video when I was uh, or one of my previous work vlogs um, I mentioned this was stuck on and said that the owner had was assuming that this was stuck on so once I got into it I realized right away that the motor wires these big old fat cable these wires were connected right up here to the line sending power directly to the motor and bypassing the switch so I don't know what the heck happened there the last handyman or whoever put this in somehow I don't know what in the world would possess them to remove these I don't know why those, these would ever need to be removed but those were detached and attached up here making sure the motor always had power and it would never turn off that way they were assuming this was stuck on um, but it was obvious that was not the case so um, I think up as well so anyway it's all wired up right now a little you know got the yeah anyway okay Let's see what happens for any leaks or anything. Except for a little bit of a leak, looks like we're all good, up and running. Nothing wrong with it. I love an easy fix. Um, just put a. Try and just get that to turn off with a wrench. Freaking sweet, look at that beast. Air pressure for days. That'd be good for using the plasma cutter, impact tools, and other big pneumatics that don't quite do so well on the little, uh, what is this, three gallon something? 4.5 gallon? This thing runs out fast, very fast, even with just an impact gun. So this is gonna be nice to have when I work on the RV in the future, so button it up and go tell the owner his uh, air compressor has nothing wrong with it, which make him happy. Where's the cover? Beauty.